Hi, it's Scott Allen with my thoughts on this week's rugby. The Waratahs showed a lot more attacking intent on the weekend against the Blues. Maybe Checker's message is starting to get through. They certainly seem to respond to his half-time rant. They started well with a well-executed first-phase play from a line-out. Wallabies at the 2011 Rugby World Cup. As McKibben doubled the round, gives it to Adam Ashley Cooper for Lau. And there's the ball out to Drew Mitchell. What a try, Waratahs! It starts with a ball from the back of the line-out, delivered early to Foley. He's got Beetham inside him and Horn outside him. The combination of those two runners will hold the Blues' midfield defence. He then dummies outside to Horn and gives the ball back to McKibben, who's looping around. McKibben then gives the ball to the outside men, and it becomes just a case of everybody running straight, holding their defender before giving the ball to the man outside them. The play's simple in its design, but simple is often best, and it really relies on everybody doing their job and executing well, which they did. Drew Mitchell only had that space because Ashley Cooper and Falau ran straight. Early in the second half from a scrum, it's a simple loop play, but again they're showing the intent to try something from within their own half from a first phase play. From a line out on halfway, simple play, Lucas out to Horn with a long ball, Foley wrapping around. Nothing comes of it, but again they're showing intent. Now a first phase play doesn't have to include loops and decoy runners, it can be a simple case of hands as we see here. But they've got an intent to attack from first phase, not just punch the ball up and look to do something on later phases. Here from a scrum on their own 22 with the scores locked up, fairly late in the game, they're prepared to run the ball rather than kick it deep and play territory. Good offload from Falau, and Kingston looked really good when he came on. And in this final example, with five minutes to go and scores level again, rather than kick the ball downfield and play for territory, the Waratahs set up for a first phase play off their scrum. Yes, it went wrong. Maybe they were lucky to recover the ball, but they did. Fortune favours the brave. Great play downfield by Mitchell, and then to Falau. Really, this should have been a try. But what that says to me is that the Waratahs are starting to get into an attacking mindset.